is Sally from Adirondack Suds and Scents. I'm going to be making a very basic soap today. Um, nothing fancy. It's going to be my laundry soap. In here I have 50% coconut oil and 50% lard. It's just a basic, excellent cleaning laundry bar. I'm going to be using the heat transfer method today, which means I'm going to use the heat of the lye to melt my oils. Normally I would let the oils and the lye water both come down to the same temperature and then start making my soap. But today I'm using the heat transfer method because the coconut oil and lard melt very quickly so I don't really need to um, worry about how long it's going to take. Like um, cocoa butter and stuff melts very very slowly. So, but this will work really good with the heat transfer method. So I'm going to pour in my hot, this is very hot, it has not cooled down, my hot lye water. I have my safety gloves and goggles on. Um, you might even see the steam coming up from that lye. Um, the toxic fumes are done. They, they only last about 15-20 seconds. What you see, this steam um, is um, just because it's that hot. Lye will get up to over 200 degrees sometimes. So that's why it's very important to wear all the safety equipment that you need. I'm just going to stir this till it melts all the oils. Then I will uh, give it a quick stick blend and get it in the molds. I'm going to be using uh, cavity molds today, which are individual molds or silicone mold, but they'll make the smaller, um, probably about a three, three and a half ounce bar of soap. You see this melts very, very quickly. I don't normally use the heat transfer method for any of my other soaps, just this one. And like I said, it's because I have the harder oils. Um, cocoa butter takes quite a while to, to melt. I mean, it, it's possible to do it with the heat transfer method, it's just I choose not to. Sorry if my hand was in the way. I'm right handed, so. This will create a, a very white, snow white, um, hard bar of soap. And again, it's an excellent cleaning soap. I keep a bar by my kitchen sink. Um, because it's at times it works sometimes better than dish detergent on some dishes so and I always use it to uh, to give my dish rags a good cleaning and oh my kitty cat no don't no, baby get down it's my cat bear bear I'm going to see what mommy's doing Okay, I'm going to realize I forgot my stick blender, so I'm going to head over and get that. I'll be right back. Let me give this a quick stick blend and get the little tiny bits left here. We can uh, just emulsify right up with the stick blender. Forgive me, I'm right handed, but I'm having issues with my wrist right now. Some carpal tunnel issues, so I have to use my left hand for a lot. Get this so it's emulsified. We'll get in the mold. Okay. 
no fragrance, no added frills or anything like that, so. Alright, that looks like it's going to be good. Yep, you see it's coating my stick blender, so that's good. drive a lot of people nuts because I, I'm not one to scrape every little bit off my stick blender. So, okay, we'll get the mold over here and start getting this poured. This is the multi-cavity mold that I'm going to be using. hope you can see that. Let's see how good I do with my left hand. Too bad. I know this, if you want to speed through this, feel free, but it's just, uh, not much really to talk about when I'm doing this, just very, very basic soap, so, Let's see how many I can get. Oh, no, not bad at all. Get this little tiny bit scraped out. Get just a little trial piece for me for the by the sink. Oh. I gotta have eleven bars, so that's gonna be good. Okay, so again, thanks for watching. This was my very basic um, laundry soap, half lard, half coconut oil. Um, I will bring you back for the unmolding. Thanks for watching. Adirondack says and scents. I'm going to unmold my laundry bars. Um, nice snow white bars here. I unmolded this little sample one that I had poured. And a little bit of a wet spot right here. Doing a zap test. It still zaps a little, so open. These all are okay. It's been like a little over 24 hours since this. I haven't been able to do this today. Oh, beautiful. Look at that. Nice, perfect white bar. Pop right out. Beautiful. Nothing, nothing too fancy. Come on. My cat has decided he wants to move the tripod. Like I'll just clean up the edges a little bit. Nice, perfect, hard, I mean, hard bar. All the same, so. Pop right out. Beautiful. Okay, so these are my laundry soap, laundry bar soaps. Um, it's uh, 
50% lard, 50% coconut oil, and lye. That's it. No additives, no scents, no anything. It's just a good cleansing bar. Okay, well, thanks for watching, and I hopefully have another video up very soon. So, uh, thanks for watching. I hope you subscribe and come back again. Thanks.